Bonjour, French ladies. I have been asked to do a video on how and what French women eat, as they seem to be so slim even when of a certain age. Obesity rates in France are about half to that in the US. You may ask why, Marianne. So in this video today, I am going to give you a top eating habits that helps us stay slim throughout the day and how you can apply this to your own life too. Stay to the end for the main one I think makes all the difference. The first thing that we do in France when we wake up is drink a glass of water. Typically, the water will not be cold, but at room temperature, this kickstart our digestive system so that we can ready for breakfast and with a good squeeze of fresh lemon to it. Throughout the day, we will continue to drink water. We are not talking about sugary drinks or diet drinks because they contain either some form of sugar or contains other things that are not natural and we don't like that too much. So we will drink water between meals, we will drink water before meals, we will drink water after meals and during the whole meals. So what can you do? How can you apply this habit to your life? Have a look at what you drink daily. Do you drink water or do you drink these diet drinks? Do you drink these lemonade and pops and sugary drinks? Then if you do, try to stop them and just stick to water. Our next habit that helps us stay slim is fresh ingredients. Here in France, we love eating great food and cooking from scratch. And of course, that means fresh ingredients. So what helps us here is our local markets. In France, we are lucky to have access to what you call in your neck of the wood, farmer's markets. And you can find absolutely every fresh local foods there. You can buy your fish from fishmongers. You can buy or the seafood, you can buy meats, bread, cheeses, and fruit and vegetables. Everything is locally produced, so you know the quality is there. It is very easy for us because there is a market every day of the week. So in the morning, you see many French people gather in a local market, and it's very good for socializing, or have a coffee with your friends, and you can buy all your local fresh food ready for your lunch. Even though we shop in our super and hypermarkets, we still love shopping in our markets. We place a very high value the freshness of our ingredients, the quality of our ingredients, and of course the provenance. So we can ask any shopkeeper the provenance of a piece of meat, or the vegetables, or the seafood that they are selling. And of course, those market stores are such a good source of ideas for recipes. They can advise you on how to cook this and that, what goes with, with that meal or that, that piece of fish or that seafood or that cheese. Even they can recommend some wine. What is the best wine to drink with this? So what about you? What can you do? Well, do you have any local markets in your area? If you don't, what about farms? Do you have farms around you? Maybe they have a farm shop that you could shop at for fresh food. Or what about at your supermarket? Do they have fresh eyes? Or maybe you could arrange to have some fresh food delivered to your own doorstep. Try to find a produce seller that is as passionate about this produce as you are in you eating it. And that will be a match made in heaven. Do you have access to local markets? Please let us know below. So we are moving swiftly through the day and now we are at lunch, our main meal in France. And why lunch is our main meal? Is because you take your time to eat and you will have more time to digest the food. And this is why we are renowned in France to have long lunches. If you have ever been to France, you must have noticed that between 12 and 2, not much is happening. You will also have noticed that restaurants at lunchtime get filled to the brim. And this brings us to our eating habits. Our meals are special. Our lunch is very special indeed. We take the time to eat. We take the time to socialize. We make our meals special with the atmosphere. We are enjoying the food, the fresh ingredients, the quality of the food. It is almost like a celebration, a celebration of food and eating and our fellow diners. 
what can you do? How can you apply this eating habit to your life? Well, have a look at how you eat. Do you tend to eat on the run? Sitting down, for instance, on a table that is set for the meal. Take your time to eat. Make your meal ultra special. And you will see that will change your life. Our next eating habit that helps us to stay slim. It is the no snacking rule. After your lunch is over, you have quite a few hours where we don't eat. But we have a really strong rule in France of the no snacking. Pas de grignotage. Marianne, how do you do it all these hours without snacking? Well, please stay to the end because that will be my last tip. How can you apply this eating habit to your own life? And I know it may be very difficult for many of you, but have a look at what you do. Do you tend to snack? At which time? Are there habits? Do you tend to snack when you're bored or when you're stressed? Or maybe at a certain times when you come back from work, for instance, and you tend to snack in the car or on the train. Do you think you can change these habits? Do you think you can stop yourself from buying those snacks and eating them? What about the drinking glass of water instead of eating those snacks? In all likelihood, you are dehydrated. For a next eating habit that helps French women stay slim, it is the overeating. So here we are in our evening meal. So there has been quite a few hours since we have eaten anything. So of course, you are very hungry. So what do you do? Well, you rush to eat, you start eating while cooking, you start eating before even sitting down. You rush your meal, you eat very quickly, you hardly breathe, you hardly drink, and um, you take seconds. So it is this eating too much and eating far too fast that will make you gain weight. That it takes about 20 minutes for your brain to receive the message from your stomach that you are full. This is why I advise to eat slowly. It gives you time to, for that message to reach you. And of course, to listen to your body and to stop as soon as you start feeling full. And of course, eating slowly has so many benefits. You can enjoy your food so much better. You take time to taste the flavors. You take time to, to smell and enjoy your food. And of course, to socialize, to talk. And this is a, such a big part of French people's way to eat, the social aspect of our meal. So if you make your meal enjoyable, all this will make you slow down, enjoy your food so much better, and you won't overeat. And now for a most important eating habit that helps us French women stay slim, self-discipline. That self-discipline that tells us to eat slowly, not have seconds, to have smaller portions, to not snack, to prepare food with fresh ingredients, to not overeat and to stop when we feel full. If you enjoyed this video, you'll love this one.